seems boring, right? So first, let's replace the word exercise with physical activity. Now you must be thinking that it is also a boring word. Word physical activity seems boring, but it has many interesting meanings. In this world of internet and technology, we have completely forgotten about physical activity. If you are in office, you spend the whole day in front of computer. If you are in a school, you spend the entire day sitting on a chair. I'm not asking you to immediately stop your mind and start running. In this busy routine, we should at least take out 30 minutes doing some physical exercise. It is nowhere written that exercise should be same every day. From today, you will choose your activity according to your mood. So today, I'm gonna give you must trying activity ideas which fulfill your daily need, give you mind relaxation, make your body healthier and will even maintain your interest. Before starting the video, I would like to mention that regular and proper exercise is really important. These ideas could not replace exercise by 100% but if it is difficult for you to do proper exercise every single day, so you must try these ideas. Number 1. Playing like a kid The word playing has no limit of age. Why we think that playing just suits on children? Why we think that we are mature and we shouldn't do anything childish? Being childish in your personal life is not bad at all. But please don't try this formula in your professional life you would be kicked out of your job. Just try this in your personal life and in the matters which are not serious. So if you have a child in your home, make him and yourself happy at the same time and physical activity is a bonus point. Take him to a park and ask that what he play with his friends. You can do a race with him up to a winning point. In race, mostly the adults win. So if you think you will win in every competition, go try something in which you are not good and the child is. Like jumping the rope. Do a competition of jumping the rope, the one who jumps the rope more times will win. The games with kids can also be played at home. Play hide, play hide and seek, make him hang on your back and give him a tour of whole house. I also have a secret tip. If you don't have any child in your home, so you can also hire a kid from your neighbor. But don't let your neighbor know about the actual reason behind this. Now, there is one problem. What if you hate my idea of being childish? What if you hate children and they annoy you? However, there might be less people who hate children too much. But what if you are one of them? So, for that case, I have a solution too. Number 2 is playing like an adult. Playing like an adult doesn't mean you are sitting and playing just like an 80 years old man. There are thousands of games in the world which are played by the age group 18 to 40. So after spending an hour with a child, the next day you can try playing adult games with friends or only one friend. Maybe the first game which came in your mind is football. Football is more interesting with 4 players where 2 are in the center of ground and 2 are goalkeepers. But the game can be played without goalkeepers. Now the actual question which might be circulating in your mind is what if we don't have a football ground nearby? So in that case remember that the purpose is to do physical exercise for half an hour. Not winning a world cup, you can have a plastic ball and play in your nearby park. Badminton can also be played in the park. It is the best game to play in a park if there is no wind. Playing badminton is actually a good exercise. You jump to throw back the cork. You pick the cork 100 times from the ground which bends you properly. Personally, this is my favorite game. Other than football and badminton, you can also play frisbee or flying disc in a park. Cricket, baseball, volleyball, basketball, hockey, ice hockey can also be played if you have their specific grounds or halls and enough number of players. Number 3 is dancing. If you want to do physical activity with dance, then first you have to take some dancing classes. No, that's not true. Yes, I agree that dancing and singing needs a lot of talent, but don't you sing or whisper your favorite song in a really bad voice every day? Everyone do that because they know that they are singing to make themselves happy. They are not singing for a singing competition. Dancing badly is a pretty harder than singing badly because in singing you know that what to sing, but in dancing you don't know the steps. So you don't need to take classes, just go to your room, change your dress and wear a really comfortable dress. Let the music start in a high volume and then try to dance using steps from the music video. But if the steps are too harder, then do whatever you think is easy. 
Now remember that you shouldn't lose energy during the dance. However, you can take a break after 15 minutes and then restart with a new stamina. Number 4. Doing physical activity and routine work together. This point is for those who are saying that they don't have enough time to take out 30 minutes every day for physical exercise. So you have to do physical exercise going to your school or work. If you are going to your school or college by van, so say them goodbye and start going through your old bicycle which you haven't used for a very long time. If a school is really near, so you can also go by walk. For offices, I would not recommend going by walk because it will make you a bit messy while bicycle won't. Another idea which is for everyone living in an apartment on 4th to 5th floor, they should stop using elevator from today and start going through stairs. But if you are at 10th floor, don't go through stairs up to 10th, go to 5th by stairs and rest by elevator. Caution: Don't use the elevator first or you would not be able to get out of it after 5. Another idea which may come in your routine life is shopping. Everyone goes shopping at least in a month for grocery and if you have grocery in your home and you have time then go for a window shopping in a very beautiful shopping mall. Number 5. Swimming. Of course this point is not for the people who didn't have a pool in their house or who don't know even swimming as taking bath is very refreshing and we feel relaxed after it. Swimming also flushes out all the stress from your brain and make you feel better. In this way, you can do physical activity and have mind relaxation at the same time. Number 6. Skating. Skating can be done by two ways. One way is skating shoes and the second is skating board. However, if you don't know to ride on both of these, so don't take a start with a skating board because it is a bit difficult than skating shoes. And for beginners, four-wheeler skating shoes must be used. It is literally very easy to learn about it and if you don't want to buy and do practice with any of these stuff, then you should go cycling round in a field. Number 7. Make your pet happy. If you have a pet dog or cat, take them to a long walk. You can also go to the park and play with them games like flying disc or with ball. In this way, you both will have activity at the same time. Remember that dogs are really loyal. Don't disappoint them by not giving time to them. If you make them happy, they would become more loyal to you. I also have a bonus secret and pro tip. Don't share it with anyone or the loss will be yours. If you see a thief, Snatching someone's purse and running, run after him. It will make you physically active. Okay, just kidding. So, finally, these were the 7 easy ways of doing regular exercise. Yes, I'm not counting the thief one. So try these ideas and tell me about your experience in the comment section. If you are going to try any one of these ideas, leave a like. It will help me making more interesting videos.